My name is Elaine Pettigrew, but I was Elaine Burnett, and my mother was Marion Agert Burnett, and she died when I was three, 1948. We knew my mom was buried here, but we didn't know where she was, and we didn't know that she didn't have a headstone. And we used to come out here every weekend and run around the, the tombstones looking for her. <laughs> I went out to my grandmother's, and I said to her, I said, I don't know where my mom's buried. I had no idea. So we got in the car right that day. They brought me out here and uh, showed me where the lot was, and there was nothing there, like just a plain piece of land, nothing. And at that point, I thought, she's gonna have a headstone. <laughs> so, um, but anyway, uh, yeah. I didn't know my mother, really. She was a person, and she, she, has, she had nothing there. Like, you come to the, the cemetery here, all these stones, my mother had nothing. And I just thought, you know what, she's, she's got to have something before I die. That was the only thing on my bucket list. My one brother now, Jim, he did not know where she was buried. I said, have you been to the grave? And he said, no. I took him over to him, I showed him the, the plot, and we were standing there, we were both crying. It just, yeah, yeah. We never got the headstone to last year. My dad passed away last year, he was 99, and uh, I decided when he had passed away that it's about time, because I'm not getting any younger either, so my brother and I decided this is it, we're, we've got to do it. Memorials are in your heart, and it's just our job is to get them out of your heart and onto granite, onto bronze, and onto some memorials. Woodlawn's memorial design team were honored to design and supply the memorial for Elaine's mother. It's been a good process, right from the day I walked in the door, right from the minute I walked in the door. I was very comfortable with everything. We didn't have any hassles anywhere along the line. Like, it was so smooth, it was so easy. I, I enjoyed doing it. I enjoyed looking through the books and picking out things, and I'd say, can I have this? She'd say, you can have anything you want. And I just, I'm just so pleased with the stone. I'm just so pleased with it. And I, you know, because I'm doing it for my mother too. Something that's gonna be there now long after I'm gone.